What's up guys? This is David from walkartdev.com. We're going to go over the constructors for the stack abstract data type. Uh, here's our header file. You can find that on the website and in the notes below. Uh, what you're going to do is uh, go ahead and paste that in there and then we'll get started. For To make it simple here, I'm just going to implement it below this. And first we'll do the, the default constructor and you gotta copy the same thing that you have listed up in the uh, the header file there little open brackets uh, the first thing you want to do is we're gonna set allocated size to the size that was passed in okay the next thing we're gonna do is set the top equal to negative one because it's empty and then we'll set data equal to new int and then we're gonna make this allocated size because we want to go ahead and, and get the full size and that's it for the default constructor that we have up here and the next one we're gonna do is the copy constructor so just same as before and here we're gonna put in the constant stack s since we're passing in a stack to this method now the first thing we're gonna do is set data equal to new int and then we're gonna make it s dot allocated size because we want it to be just as big as the one that we're passing in okay and then next we're gonna go a we're gonna use a for statement here we're gonna start with zero and then for each time that n is smaller than s dot top we'll do the following here we get a we'll increment by one here what we're gonna do is make this data equal to s data well you gotta make sure and put in let me go back and fix that so we are actually assigning the data values that we are passing in to our new stack for each one and then after that's done we're gonna set you know this top to equal s top and then that's it for that the next one's gonna be the destructor And then all we've got to do here is delete data. Now I've got to put the tilde in that. So we'll save this. Let's go over here to our driver for this. And we'll just implement a few stack S1 make it six long stack s2 will make it eight long stack s3 and we'll pass in s1 and stack s4 and pass in s2 Okay, let's build this and see what happens. Okay, it succeeded. And we'll run it.
it and debug here and right there you can see our test before and after text 